mo papa nka ga ene na saturday house of assembly kene nda ga tulu ma ga tulu oketa ka faputa ba ale bakwa ma yo biko na ebu ikpele ma ga ebu ni ne nya ma ndi sana fa bo ho ebu ifa before no 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 ka don take that nonsense oketa ajo ko yo kwa biko o biko ka na nya na ana ebu ikpele nke mere ebe kere ko su wele sunday mar de ne o ga ji pare yo wanka atu kwale nya na ndotu ya oye kwa mmadu mmadu ka mmadu ka kwa mmadu obu mmili uregi ebu ala yu wabiko eye akwa ulu mmili wana kwa ili yu ili iku ni kwa ulu do ulu do akwa kwa pito ya mewe ni mwana 25% mwana 3 states na mwana kwa ina refeto oye na chana mwana states ok oye mwana kutelifu ni na mwana kwa asura mwana pito ya mwana kwa mwana kwa mwana Before you know, twenty-five. No, you have to put twenty-five percent. I want to know a million, million. No, you have to one quarter of the votes in three states in Nigeria. Also, not three quarters. If you are a quarter, yeah. Now, 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 12 states article we in 12 states pito bia wa ani okunu we bo na eje we in 12 states we na declare kwali okwa we the election in nigeria we only 25% na 20 states pito bi we 25% na 20 states all wrong we one quarter of the vote na nka akpala akpo etirio result ye to abi pito we 25% na 30 states ene bi Oya ki ya wu kucha na maybe igena se kwa 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 abatu alge kama unke gina wanya in the House of Assembly. If you judge me gede oge me state broadcast, apologize ya to Ubiana Ambra State, apologize ya to Ndebo, apologize ya to Peter Obi. All about your personal convenience. He played God in a matter that touched our existence as a people. Kiri mo jume House of Assembly me. Ndi gana kwa di, kwa mgeni. Peter Obi is now the leader of the political movement in Nigeria. Not in Ibo. He is now the beacon of hope in Nigeria. He is the person everybody is looking up to in Nigeria for salvation of this country. This is the man he undermined. We bana agwasi tuale ya ona kwa meeting the teacher. We went meeting up by my front. I'm the one report of all the meetings on agbo since last Sunday. I'm, I'm following him, I'm monitoring him. If I'm never an exercise in fertility, because now, I'm going to buy some new work out here, or I'm going to buy some new work out here. And House of Assembly, I'm going to buy property of a governor. The, the, the executive and the legislature and the judiciary are meant to be independent of each other. So that the executive recklessness, like he has demonstrated in Amber State, will be checked by the legislature. So in Kona, Jack, Bond, and they haven't been kind, and they haven't been kind. All nonsense, Kobo. Right. Thank you. We want independent legislature in Anambra State so that when he begins to do what is not right, the legislature will checkmate him. Right. So even the cook had to call here, even the Jaguar man, and they may impeach. 18 the labor, the labor may impeach. And they may impeach for what? If you don't commit impeachable offense, nobody will impeach you. If you are afraid of your shadow, you begin to think about how to muscle and control the legislature. So if he's above board and is clean and is confident in himself that he knows what he's doing as a governor, he should go and face his work. Face his work. The legislature will do its work. These lawmakers are not going to be rubber stamp to anybody. Ah, okay. So what he's looking for is a legislature that will be rubber stamp mm. to his own government. That's not what we want. I'm going to the National Assembly. I'm coming back to that later. But let me tell you, the only way democracy can thrive in Nigeria is when you have independent legislature, independent judiciary, then the executive arm of government. Mm. They are meant to check met each other. Have you seen it? Mm. So when somebody is afraid of his shadows, he begins to seek control. I want to use this opportunity to tell our people not to pay attention to such a cry 
It's crocodile tears. It doesn't, the governor Soludo doesn't need House of Assembly members to do his work. It is better that to have an independent legislature that to put him in check. Even the insult on him in the matter and his arrogance will be checkmated by the House of Assembly. He will be cool-headed. He will not do his work. I do not support any impeachment of any governor, but I do not think that a governor needs a rubber stamp legislature for him to work. Okay. Peter B was governor here for the first term, his first term. He was governor here without any Afghan member in the House of Assembly. When they tried to impeach him early after eight months, they did it successfully because of their number. They failed because at the court will set it aside. And he remained governor for the four years he served without any member of Abga in the House of Assembly. And he succeeded. So it's for you to know what you are doing. If you don't have skeleton in your cupboard, you allow the legislature to float, you know, to move on, do its own work. All right. And that is the only way you can have a robust democracy. When the legislature is independent, the judiciary is independent, right. and the executive is independent. Darine, yes. Darine, distinguished